Hi, Paul Hefty here with the Triangle O football system. I want to go over our power run action pass where we use what we call a stubble route concept. We'll first show it out of a pistol set, then a sidecar, and then what we call our veer sidecar. Let's take a look. All right, the run action power pass is a very simple, very sound, high percentage run action pass to use at all levels. This is something we started using back in 2015 at the ninth grade level with lots of success. Some key points here. It is run action, so that means the backside guard will still skip pull for the mic as he would with power, but obviously since it's pass, not go down field. When we give a north verbal cue, that always does tell the tackles they must stay big on big, both the backside and the front side. Next key point. The running back, after his fake of power, he must get down into the line of scrimmage to give him quality fake, but he checks the will first to the Sam, looking inside out. Receivers, H is now going to attack the outside shoulder of the defensive end as if he's doing a bad J black for power, but then avoids contact and runs his bender peak read at the second level, finding open grass. The stubble concept here is real simple. The Z and the X both run stop routes, which is four steps vertical and then two at a 45 degree angle inside and hitch it up with the A running the bubble. So that's our stop bubble stubble. Simple reprogression for the quarterback. Key starts here with him making a long ride fake down in the line and selling that to get receivers open. His eyes are on the Sam making him his focus read key, looking for the H on the bender. If he doesn't like that, he goes right to the stop route to the bubble, the stubble concept. As always, if he feels he has free access to the back side, um, he can go ahead after his right fake and come right back to the X on a solo. You can see here, this is out of pistol. So we use our same techniques all the way through with our power to power pass. Next, we can run it out of sidecar. Same exact rules, everything applies. Only thing changes now is the quarterback does a rocker step versus a pivot. Again, needs to have a long ride down into the line of scrimmage and then plant and throw. Key here is as he's making this long ride, this is where he makes his decision if he's going to the H or to the stop or the bubble. When we run it out of two by two, again, he can determine if he has pre-snap access to the two receiver side, the Z and the A, and he can, after his fake, come right back and go one, two. Last, we can do this out of a veer power, and if we do it out of sidecar, then the running back aligns towards the play. Nothing changes. Again, from sidecar, quarterback just uses his rocker technique. Again, long mesh, right into side. Same progression, if he feels he has pre-access, he can come right back to the Z and the A with the stubble. If not, he'll go ahead and ride into side, reading the H on the peak to the stop, to the strong side. Great, simple, sound, high completion percentage. And again, if you're a team that power is one of your core RPOs, it's one you must run. Thanks.